This is the white paper for Pax Gold, version 1.0, last updated September 5th, 2019, by Charles Casarilla, Chief Executive Officer and Co-Founder of Paxos. Abstract. Historically, gold has played a significant role in the global financial system. It is scarce, chemically stable, malleable, beautiful, and universally precious. It has endured as a store of value for thousands of years and remains wildly popular today, with an average of $112.2 billion worth of gold trades occurring daily through ETFs, derivatives, and physical markets. Gold endures as a preferred safe haven in crisis, is wildly recommended as part of a diversified investment portfolio, and continues to be the preferred asset over local currencies for billions of individuals in countries with unstable fiat tender. At Paxos, we are on a mission to digitize and mobilize the world's assets. We have a vision for a future where assets can move globally 24-7 in a frictionless economy. We see gold as being an ideal asset for our efforts as it is uniquely desirable yet unwieldy, its market value is more than $9 trillion, despite being a physically cumbersome and expensive asset to own, store, and move. In this paper, we introduce Pax Gold, a tokenized version of gold that represents real, physical gold. It gives token holders actual gold ownership in the most secure vaults in the world, along with the portability of a digital wallet. We provide some historical context to demonstrate the importance of a modern digital approach to gold access. Finally, we present details about the infrastructure behind the product, including our structure as a regulated trust company, the technical design of our smart contracts, and other details of our operations. We have created the easiest way for people to affordably own, hold, trade, lend, or move investment-grade physical vaulted gold, without the worry, cost, or inconvenience of physical storage and security. Pax Gold mobilizes and democratizes access to gold globally. Introduction to Pax Gold Today's gold market is defined by a fundamental contradiction. There is currently no investment-grade physical gold product that is both easy to own and easy to trade. Buyers can own large quantities of physical, allocated, investment-grade gold, but it is expensive to store, not easily divisible, cumbersome to move, and, therefore, very difficult to trade or leverage. Alternatively, investors can trade wholesale, unallocated gold, gold ETFs or gold futures, which are all derivatives or securities, but not ownership of the underlying gold. The product being traded is merely synthetic gold value. In other words, the price of liquidity and fungibility for gold investors, or any commodity investor, is the lack of ownership in the real physical asset. Paxos provides an innovative solution to these fundamental trade-offs with Pax Gold. It is a digitized version of real physical gold in the highest quality. London Bullion Market Association accredited London Good Delivery Gold Bars held in the most secure vaults in the world. These investment-grade gold bars are typically about 400 fine troy ounces, each worth over 600000 according to today's market prices in August 2019, and therefore typically only accessible to the largest of institutions. By tokenizing this gold and putting it on the blockchain, Paxos is making it possible for anyone to own fractions of this highly desirable and secure gold. Pax Gold solves the fundamental challenges of the gold market and democratizes access. Each Pax G token represents one fine troy ounce of physical gold from a specific serialized gold bar. If customers own enough Pax G to represent an entire gold bar, they can redeem their tokens for a bar of gold. On the other hand, ownership can be divided into units up to 18 decimal points making it possible to own minuscule amounts of top-quality gold for the first time. PAX-G is built as an Ethereum-based ERC-20 token so that it has portability across the Ethereum blockchain's extensive network of wallets, exchanges, lenders, and other platforms. 
Paxos is uniquely positioned to offer a gold token as it is the only company to hold all of the following distinctions. 1. Paxos Trust Company is a regulated financial institution and qualified custodian. Paxos is a state-chartered trust company regulated by the New York State Department of Financial Services, NYDFS, and must uphold the highest standards of customer asset protection. Additionally, the NYDFS has approved and regulates PaxG. 2. Paxos maintains relationships with large institutions in the gold market due to Paxos history providing post-trade products, including confirmation and affirmation services, to the gold and broader FX and commodity market. As a result, it has been able to secure partnerships with top gold providers, vaults, and miners to ensure Pax Gold is only supported by the highest quality gold and stored in some of the most reliable vaults in the world. 3. Paxos has established success in creating asset-backed tokens. Paxos is the issuer and custodian of the asset-backed token Paxos Standard, PAX, as well as the custodian of the asset-backed token HUSD. Paxos understands the intricacies of the technology and business requirements needed to build a product and create a market for this class of offering. Pax Gold solves the challenges of today's gold market by marrying the benefits of physical gold ownership with the speed and mobility of digital assets. A Brief History of Gold Understanding the historical role of gold helps to contextualize how important it has been and continues to be in society. Gold had a role in commerce dating back to the emergence of ancient human civilizations. As the technical capacity for the production of goods became more sophisticated, metals became useful in developing monetary systems. Gold in particular was durable, malleable, attractive in color, unlikely to corrode or decay, and, above all, scarce. Its universal desirability led it to becoming a store of value across generations and geographies. The Greeks were the first civilization known to use gold to create coins used in commerce more than 2,500 years ago. Until the 20th century, gold was used as the primary medium of exchange and the basis for most monetary systems. For example, in 1717, Great Britain adopted the gold standard and the United States followed with a gold-silver standard in 1792. Under these systems, the value of the local currency was affixed to a set weight of gold and or silver. The greatest challenge to the gold standard was the outbreak of World War I, as many major economies shifted away from the system to expand monetary supply, monetary turbulence around the world settled after the end of World War II, when the Bretton Woods Agreement of 1944 established the gold standard-based U.S. dollar as the underlying currency to which 44 other nations pegged their currencies. This system remains in place until 1971, when the U.S. dollar was officially taken off the gold standard and rendered a fiat currency. Government issued money without intrinsic value or gold backing. Since that time, the fiat currency system has evolved and helped facilitate a global economy. But the value of fiat in comparison to gold has diverged widely. In comparison to the value of gold, today's U.S. dollar has lost 97% of its value. One ounce of gold, worth $38 in 1971, is today worth more than $1,500. Other fiat currencies have depreciated even further. Gold has become an individual asset class with distinct market dynamics. It's also featured in investor portfolios all over the world as a long-term investment that retains or steadily increases in value. Despite these evolving dynamics, gold has maintained its desirability and value. More than $3.5 trillion of the total gold available today is used solely for investment purposes. But the core challenges remain. Gold is a heavy and cumbersome asset that is not easily movable nor broadly accessible. The Present Day Gold Market Investment Grade Physical Gold this market analysis is focused on the largest wholesale market for high-quality gold, the local London markets. Standardized by the London Bullion Market Association, LBMA, 
that LBMA sets standards for gold bars and the refiners that produce bars for the London market. The most trustworthy gold bars that meet the highest standards for quality and are produced by accredited refiners are referred to as London Good Delivery Bars. These bars are generally 400 fine troy ounces, but can range between 350 and 430 fine troy ounces, with a minimum fineness of 99.5% gold. Each bar has a set of markings that denotes the bar's individual serial number, its refiner, its fineness, and the year of manufacture. The LBMA ensures refiners that produce London Good Delivery Bars adhere to quality standards and responsible sourcing practices. London Good Delivery Gold can be purchased in two forms, allocated and unallocated. A customer purchasing allocated gold has ownership over specific gold bars that can be held in a vault or by the customer. A customer purchasing unallocated gold does not have ownership over specific gold bars, but rather has entitlement to some share of a certain quantity of gold. Challenges of today's gold market Most processes related to buying, selling, transferring, confirming, and settling of gold assets between parties remains largely manual, opaque, and outdated. The reliance on manual processing is error-prone and impacts the flow and liquidity of the market in a meaningful way. The market is largely restricted to qualified investors, practically meaning that much of the value of gold is not readily available or widely accessible. Additionally, the size and weight of physical gold is a fundamental challenge to the market. Physical gold bars are difficult to transport and costly to store, so investors find it too cumbersome of an asset in which to invest. These challenges exist for both institutional and retail investors of gold bullion. Today's methods for investing overcome some of these inherent physical challenges, but each market venue or instrument has its own unique limitations. Buying and selling gold. There are a few primary ways to acquire investment-grade gold. Over-the-counter, OTC trading, gold exchange-traded funds, ETFs, gold futures, or retail gold outlets. Over-the-counter trading, OTC. The majority of investment-grade gold is traded over-the-counter as unallocated gold in spot markets. The London over-the-counter OTC bullion market is the largest spot market, with approximately 80% global market share. In order to participate in this market, customers, almost exclusively institutions, must have a direct or indirect account with one of the members of the LBMA. Five clearing banks, forming the London Precious Metals Clearing Limited, LPMCL, manage the clearing and settling of unallocated gold for the entire London bullion market. The LPMCL are the banks that maintain gold accounts for settlement of trades with each other and on behalf of third-party counterparties. Once physical gold has been traded and acquired on an unallocated basis, a purchaser can ask for physical delivery allocated gold, which generally takes several days and incurs an additional fee. The gold is secured, stored, and safeguarded at a precious metal security facility within locked London vaults. Gold Exchange Traded Funds, ETFs, and Futures Gold ETFs track the underlying value of the gold commodity and are marketable equity securities that can be traded on security exchanges. ETFs are more accessible to investors than OTC as there are low barriers to entry, brokerage account, requiring only a brokerage account. They can be easily bought and sold like other equity securities while tracking the price of gold. Gold ETFs are backed by either physical gold or futures contracts. Futures contract represents the price of a fixed quantity of gold with a predetermined date for future delivery. Nearly 27 million ounces of gold futures are traded daily on commodity exchanges, the NY-based COMEX being the largest in the world. Gold futures are often used as a way to speculate or hedge price risk. Futures are complex financial instruments that provide significant leverage, 10 to 20 percent, 10 to 20 x, and may be risky for unsophisticated investors that do not have a significant amount of capital at hand. Additionally, futures contracts expire every three months, and redeeming for physical gold requires certain minimums and can be difficult and costly. Retail Gold Outlets 
Gold bars and coins of varying weights can be purchased directly through gold refiners or bullion dealers. At retail, consumers typically purchase fractional amounts of gold, such as an ounce of gram bars or coins. Smaller bars and coins have higher retail markups and their purity is difficult to guarantee. The average retail buyer usually does not have either the capital, 600000 or the storage capabilities required to buy large, institutional-grade bars, nor the ability to manage the complexity of buying London Good Delivery bars directly. Past Attempts to Digitize Gold There have been multiple attempts to create a digital representation of gold, both blockchain and non-blockchain based, but none have achieved significant market scale. Many are backed by gold of unknown origin, i.e. not London good delivery bars, or are not even necessarily backed by physical gold. Another major drawback is the way in which storage fees are treated. Some stipulate that any exchange or wallet that holds users' tokens must remove a certain amount on a regular basis to account for custody fees. Others make the token depreciate in value to account for fees. Neither are optimal, and therefore typical crypto asset exchange venues have been reluctant to list these tokens for trading. The Design of Pax Gold Basics Pax Gold is a digital asset where one token represents one fine troy ounce of a London Good Delivery Gold Bar stored in professional vaults in London. Anyone who owns Pax Gold owns the underlying gold, which is held under the custody of Paxos Trust Company. The value of Pax Gold therefore also attracts the real-time market price of gold. Pax Gold is built on an Ethereum-based token following the ERC-20 protocol, making it compatible with all Ethereum wallets that accept ERC-20 tokens. All transactions operate according to the rules of the smart contract on the Ethereum blockchain. Because of this smart contract, transactions eliminate human error and the system operates only as programmed. Like any Ethereum-based token, Pax Gold is available 24-7 to facilitate settlement against various assets. Unlike traditional gold, which is only available to settle trades during banking business hours, Pax Gold can move anywhere, anytime. Key Product Benefits 1. Allocated Pax Gold is backed by physical gold and is allocated down to the serial number of each individual bar. Because Pax Gold operates on the Ethereum blockchain, it is also instantly transferable globally. The allocated ownership moves with the token transfer, which makes trading of allocated gold easier and faster than ever. 2. Redeemable Pax Gold is redeemable in several forms, unlike any gold products available today. Customers can convert their Pax Gold into physical allocated gold, unallocated gold entitlements, or fiat. Through Paxos.com, customers can redeem full-sized London Good Delivery Gold Bars. Through a network of gold retailers, they can convert smaller amounts to physical gold all over the world. 3. Programmable Due to the digital and programmable nature of the smart contract, Pax Gold is easy to convert, trade, or use in many other ways. Programmable gold creates significant new functionality in the trading world. 4. Regulated Pax Gold is issued by Paxos Trust Company, a financial institution regulated by the NYDFS. The NYDFS also regulates Paxos individual products, ensuring greater customer protections and higher standards of operation. The NYDFS has specifically approved Pax Gold as an authorized and regulated Paxos product. 5. Available to anyone. Given that Pax Gold has a very low investment minimum, 0.01 Pax or $15, fractional bar ownership is now possible for retail customers unlike ever before. Any individual or institution can buy Pax Gold. 6. Low fees. Pax Gold has low fees and is a significantly more attractive vehicle for investments as compared to other gold products. There are no storage fees and low creation slash destruction fees that are tiered based on volume. For transactions that occur on-chain, transferred via Ethereum, there is a low Paxos transaction fee, 0.02%, 
as well as the usual Ethereum gas fees, typically a few cents. 7. Bankruptcy Remote Since Pax Gold is issued by a state charter trust company, customer assets are kept separately from the company's assets. All gold bars represented by Pax Gold tokens are custodied by Paxos for Pax Gold holders and do not become a part of the company's estate in the event of the company's insolvency. 8. Decentralized By operating on an open blockchain, Pax Gold maintains the inherent nature of gold. No single entity or group controls access to the asset or has the ability to control the entire market. 9. Easy to trade on Paxos, ITBIT, and other exchanges, PaxG will trade against fiat and digital assets.